Hey, it's Monday evening. We've been busy today, as you all know, and out there making making progress. But we've seen a lot of things, and we're still finding things that are surprising us. And in fact, Brittany's been out today with our operations superintendent, out with the crews, out with our foreign crews, checking on them, documenting things. And she's seen some things that I heard her talking and telling a coworker, and I said, hey, we need to tell the public about that. What did you see down at Matthews? Oh, Matthews is a mess. South of our Matthews substation is a wreck. There's a, I call it a levee. It's a giant ditch. All of the poles are leaning. If they're not leaning, they're inside the bottom of that ditch and it's probably a hundred feet deep. And these linemen are fishing with a hook, these poles back out. Some of those poles are still good, so they're trying to set them, but there's debris and all kinds of things coming up with that. Wires are coming out. It's, it's just an ugly mess. And the road's very narrow for them to get through and get around and turn around. So. It's very messy. And Frisco was the same way. Check out my boots. <laughs> Brittany's been in the mud today. She's been out with the guys. She's out there yesterday. Uh, here comes Brad. We just got a lot of traffic, and right now we're setting up for dinner uh, somewhere between 8 and 10. After that, they'll go rest at the hotel. We'll be back here at 5 o'clock in the morning for breakfast. Uh, but it, it, is, it is a big ordeal that we're doing. Uh, I know our fellow uh, co-ops and our utility companies around us are doing the same thing. It's just not us that was hit. Uh, but again, we ask for your patience. Frisco's probably going to be tomorrow afternoon. The people in Dexter, uh, Parma, that area is probably going to be tomorrow afternoon. Matthews, probably tomorrow afternoon as well. We're going to try to narrow those times down the best we can. Again, we think from now, 36 hours for total restoration and everybody will have their power back on. But stay patient. Uh, give us a call if you need to. Please stay away from down power lines. We'll see you later. Six o'clock update. Good afternoon. And uh, got some wins this afternoon. The uh, crew that I'm with from Crawford again, getting ready to energize a section of three phase line that feeds toward Dillstad out of uh, our minor substation, effectively getting a big portion of this line back on, um, working around the uh, breakers here on the line, of course, controls it out of the sub and uh, everything's working beautifully if they did what they did right. And um, we're fixing to hear this generator you might hear in the background go silent. Um, again, folks, stay safe and uh, let us know if you need us. Keep us up to date on anything that might change in the overnight hours. Uh, a big day here and uh, looking for an even bigger one tomorrow.